Go. Oh. Ready? Go. Today what we are going to do is we are going to do a versus video between the Tack Life and Hyper Tough drill drivers. Now both of these uh, tools have a 3 8 inch chuck. All right, and so both of these are sort of uh, the both of these are in the budget line of tools. And so when it comes to visual, I like uh, the Tack Life's tools better. I love the black, all black all the way around with a little orange accent. And I do love how Tack Life did their logo. All right, so the Tack Life has a flat matte finish all the way around, and then it has a gloss uh, accent, which they also do have tools to where it's a black matte finish all the way around. So the Hyper Tough, uh, I do not like the amount of red that's in there and the design is a little eh, you know, so, but it's not bad. Uh, so let's look at the specs of these really quick and let's see what these can do. All right, so the Tack Life, uh, like I said, I love the way they, they have their logo. That's a very cool looking logo. Uh, the model number for this is a PCD06B 20 volt system, but everyone knows the 20 volt system really means 18 volt. For both of these, these both are 20 volt tools, but they're really 18 under a load. So this has a 19 point clutch plus one, which is drill, two speed settings. Uh, speed one goes to zero at a 350 RPMs, and on speed two, it goes to zero at a 1300. A uh, metal chuck with plastic housing. Actually, is that plastic? That might be metal. Let's see. Yeah, it is It is a magnet. It is metal. Uh, wow. It might not be enough, but there we go. Uh, that, that surprises me. The Tech Life uh, chuck is metal. All right, so two speed settings, uh, three eighths inch chuck. Now the batteries on Tech Life does have a fuel gauge, which is nice. It's a simple design, but that's all you need to know what the battery life is. And so yes, it really is a good little. It, it really is a good little drill. All right, so for the Hyper Tough, this is model number AQ75034G, uh, variable trigger only, 15 point clutch plus one, which is drill. Metal chuck uh, with a plastic housing. Uh, so this is, goes to zero to 600 RPMs. And there are, uh, one point, there are batteries, at least for what I know, the 1.5 amp hour does not have a fuel gauge. And so I made sure that this was full, and it is. Uh, both of these are brushed motors. And so we're gonna see what these can do against each other. And remember when you work, wear gloves and safety glasses. I got mine right here. Oh yeah. Alrighty, so we are gonna put these through a couple of extreme tests, but the majority of it's not gonna be that extreme. Yeah, we'll do a one inch, we'll start off with a one inch spade, but we are gonna do the hyper tough first. Hope that's locked in. I think it is. All right, we're gonna start off right here. Ready, go. You can do it. Oh. I'm gonna push it till I can. Oh, I smell that motor already. Oh, that, yep, yeah, that. All right, we're gonna continue. Oh, that's locked. All right, we're gonna try in speed two. If it doesn't work in speed two, we'll go to speed one. All right, so ready, go. I think yeah, speed it, it, requ it requires speed one. Look at that. Time. It did it, and it stayed. Uh, and it stayed in the chuck. We're going to start off with uh, Hyper Tough first. This should fit, and it does. You gotta, yeah, I think for Hyper Tough, you got to drill, uh, lock it in like that. 
All right, I do not know what size this is. I'm sorry. We're gonna do a couple of holes, see how, they, how well this does. All right, so ready, go. Oh. You gotta go more, uh, it, it's unlocked. It's on drill. Alright, let's do uh, attack life. Yes, it fits. Alright, so ready? Go. Uh, we're going to try speed two. I'm curious if it's capable of doing it. Alright, so ready? Go. It's through. Alright, it requires speed one. Let's do one more. Ready? Go. Easily. Alright, now the one thing that sucks with this truck was half inch, I'd be able to do a lot uh, more tests. And we're gonna start off with hyper tough first. We're gonna do a three inch hole dozer and see what these are able to do. Alright, so so ready. Go. Come on, you got it. You got it. It's all. It's it's there. There we go. Got it. Oh, hyper tough is smoking. Hyper tough smoking a little bit. Right there is good. We clear everything. All right, so ready, go. There we go. It did it. It did it. No smoking, no nothing. It's doing 141 degrees. The Hyper Tough got 141. Now it's been about a minute, about a minute and a half since this stopped. What's the tech life at? A hundred and, there we go. 112 degrees. Tech life's still going strong though. Now the Hyper Tough smoked a little bit, but nothing to be concerned about. It would be unfair if I switched out the batteries, so I'm, I'm not going to. All right, so we're going to do it right here. All right, so ready? Go. Oh, it's doing it. You can do it. You, oh. Let's try it again. Oh. Let's see if Tack Life could finish it. Yes, it can. All right, so ready, go. You can do it. You can do it. Time. Oh, a little bit more. My bad. Time. It did it. All right, so ready. I'm hoping it can. Ready, go. Alright, so ready, go. Time. Alright, let's see if uh, Hyper Tough could even take one of these out. Alright, so ready, go. Oh. Ready, go. I don't think it can. No, we... There we go. All 
All right, so I, I think we both know the winner of this one. I think Tech Life won this test. So I just wanted to do this test between the budget tools to see what which one would actually prevail with the company. Now I got this one from Amazon. I got this one from Walmart. Uh, I, I did find a couple of these kits still for forty bucks uh, at a, a certain Walmart. So uh, so yeah. So that's pretty much it. Please subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. And I'll see you guys next time.